Hi friends, this is Leela. Welcome to my channel Leela Webdev. In this video, we will see about the repetition of the specific characters to a specific amount of time. So how we can do it? So that means how we can mention the repetition amount. Up to now, what are the things we have seen? So we have seen about the star. So star means nothing but zero or more. So that means zero or many. So there is no count in this one. So we cannot mention the amount so how many times it need to repeat repeat and we have a plus that is nothing but one or more so this is one or more so we cannot we cannot have here here also the repetition amount so i want to repeat something like six times or five times or three times so we cannot mention it and here we have another one is nothing but question mark that is zero or one so that's it zero or one <clears throat> so these are the different types of meta characters we have seen in our previous session about these things star plus and the question mark now if you want to specify the particular repetition amount so that means specific repetition amount then what i need to do so here you will be having so in our regular expression so we will be having some of the options something like curly braces min comma max so you can mention min comma max that means you can mention something like specific amount of time so that means matches min to max so minimum these many characters has to be there maximum these time these many characters so it can be two to three means the so minimum two should be present and it can be two three four or five something like that min to max occurrences and the next one is nothing but min so that means minimum occurrence so this is the minimum occurrences it should be matches minimum occurrence so these many so more than these minimum things so it will not allow and another one is min comma so that means here so minimum these many occurrences are there and max you can have so uh, as much as you want so you can have as much as you can have so more occurrences so min comma so these are the three different types which we can mention the repetition amount min comma max min and min comma min comma means it will matches the min or more occurrences min means it will match the minimum occurrences min comma max means it will check the repetition amount should be between the min and max let's try to see the real time scenario of this one so i am writing something like my telephone number or anything so i am keep giving some dummy is as follows 801-55-6789 something like this now i want to match the telephone number or anything so i want to match the words that are minimum minimum thing so if i try to see here i can use something like slash w and i can mention the repetition amount here so i want to have something like minimum of three and maximum of five now if you try to see here so it is matching so here it should have minimum of three and max you can have as many five so here it is taking one two three four five so five has been matched and here there are only four so bt uh, that is in, in the range between three to five because of this reason there is an another match and here it is taking maximum of five numbers and here also it is taking maximum five so here minimum uh, minimum is there so minimum three so here three is there four so this is the type this is how it will be matching now if i try to keep here another slash w so then what will happen here so first it should have a one word followed by minimum of three to five words so that means total it should have something around four to five words okay let's try to see it so here you'll be able to see one two three four five so it is having five and here it is you see if you are able to sorry five six you are having six why because first word so here it leave it and it will try to match the maximum character so that is nothing but the five so it is taking five characters total it is six here in the same scenario it is taking the six six and here it is matching only the four why because one plus minimum of three so that is nothing but four it is matching so four it should have so like this you will be having let's remove off this one slash w and i will try to keep only three so that means exactly three so that means exactly minimum three not exactly three so three or more so here if you try to see so these many minimum uh, so not three or more exactly so what i can say is minimum of three it should have minimum of three so here if you try to see one two three so minimum of three so it is matching and, and again three sets it is matching 
another three sets is my three and here are three three so these two are not matching because it is not having minimum of three numbers and here is also three it is having three so like this it is go on matching of minimum of three characters if i try to keep three comma so minimum of three or more so here it has to contact telephone number follows so all the things it has taken so this is how we will be taking so three comma five means it should be minimum of three and maximum of five or otherwise three means it should it will take minimum of three that's it so minimum three it will take it or three comma means three or more so it should have three if it is more means it will take greediness so let's try to see uh, the same thing on the hexadecimal so let's say that i am having hash ff 0 0 0 0 okay and i am having hash c 0 c sorry c 0 c 0 0 sorry 0 these are hex numbers okay so let's try to write these are hex numbers so this is this all all the text is matching for this one so let's try to write the hexadecimal thing so how can you write to match only the hexadecimal i can take <coughs> range so here i can say something like 0 to 9 okay a to Z, f so hexadecimal ends with f only so a to f and we need to have minimum of six characters so it should have three six characters so you can mention six that's it so now it is matching exactly the hexadecimal number but it but it is not matching this one so if you want you can also mention something like a to z it will match but here it is trying to take it or otherwise what you can do is you can take this ignore case now it is matching exactly so these two things so this is how we can check it so this is how we will be right we will be selecting the exact hexadecimal numbers now let's say now let's say that um, this is the hexadecimal number so if you want you can also add something like hash so exactly you can have it so like this instead of using this a to z so a to f sorry i have used it instead of using this a to f and you can also use something like ignore case also so that is the thing i want to explain you now if i try to take uh, the social security number which exists in the us so let's take a dummy one so six six or six seven eight and whatever thing so this is a social security number and we need to write the regular expression to match the social security number so how we how we can do it that's the number let's try to see so let's try to remove this ignore case and here so we know that these are all digits so we know that we know that this was the shorthand notation so now slash d and here you can mention first one as three characters okay minimum three and here you can take d so repetitive thing it should be two and here you can write slash d so repetitive should be four so this is how we will be writing the regular expression for this one slash d and repeating of three times so it should be repeated three times slash d two times and slash d four times so this is how we can find the regular expression and if you want you can also write in a such a way that instead of writing three slash d slash d and here also you can write something like slash d and here also you can mention slash d slash d slash d so this is also the same thing only but instead of having these all the different types of things so these repetition amount comes in a handy way such that you can mention so it should be repeated three times and this one is it should be repeated two times and here this one should be repeated four times so like this we will be writing hope you understood about this repetition amount specifying this repetition amount min and max thing if you have any doubts or any suggestions please post the comments below to this video and if you like this video please do support me by subscribing to my channel thank you